What is up guys? We are back with a reaction video. I hope you're having a fantastic day. We are continuing our Beatles train. This is early Beatles once more. Please, please me. Requested by one of you guys in my She Loves You video. Never heard this one before. So why don't we just jump into it and see what it's all about. Alright, let's do it. It was our first hit in England. And this is... In England. Way back in England. And uh, this song was released in America, it didn't do anything, but it was released later again, and, uh, well, it's doing something, you know. <laughs> so, this, yeah, it is. So, so we'd like to play for you now a song called Please Please Me. from this uh why do i always have to say love why do i have to be the guy who put in all the effort can't you put in the effort some of the time isn't this a give and take it's not what it's supposed to be so the the beatles have a great way of expressing themselves through songs the lyrics are freaking moving i don't know i know they wrote their later stuff i don't know whether they wrote this the thing is, they look like they're freaking 20 years old. They're freaking taking the world by stage. Look at those freaking ladies. Look at them going nuts. They're going nuts over these guys. Oh my gosh. They just had the world on the tip of their fingers. They could do whatever they wanted. It seems that way. I wasn't alive. I don't want to sign my plan, but you know there's always rain. They did it again. They did it again. I mean, at this point, I don't know of what freaking genre to put this band. They're all over the place. They're love song. They're rock and roll. They do whatever the heck they want. But the one thing I did notice, my one critique, and I wouldn't even consider a critique. I just noticed an observation. Paul McCartney, the lead singer, he was crushing. His vocals were silky smooth throughout. But the third guy, I believe his name is George Harrison, if he sings Here Comes the Sun, right? I'm pretty sure you guys told me that. Oh my gosh, his voice progressed so much. Like, watch it back. Watch his singing part. You can hear some, like, voice cracks or whatever, but it's still singing good, especially because he's doing the lead parts on the guitar. It's just amazing to see how the Beatles kept getting better and better and better as the years progressed. You would think over time they would just become a rift and they would, like, hate playing with each other, but it seemed like they were just getting better and better and better as they played longer. I don't know what it is, but it's something about the early Beatles and their energy that I just love so much. But anyway, speaking about guitar solos, what are the top three Beatles guitar solos in their entire catalog? I'll try and check those out, and I hope you guys enjoyed this. If you did, make sure to smash that like, comment, subscribe, and take it easy, everybody. Till next time.